Hi, this is Ethan from Printed Village, and today, in honor of our new Birds of a Feather competition, I'm going to show you guys <clears throat> a quick shortcut to draw a feather in Photoshop. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to do is make a new layer, and I have my brush tool out, and the color is set to black. I'm going to zoom in, size my brush down a little, and I'm going to draw, holding shift, a horizontal straight tapered line. Something like that. I'm going to hit Command J to duplicate it. Go up to Edit, Transform, flip it horizontally, slide it over so it's just touching, and now holding Shift again with the brush tool, I'm just going to draw a little vertical line through the middle of it. All right, now select both of these layers and hit Command E to merge them. Get the Marquee tool and draw a box right around that. Now go to Edit. Define Brush Preset, and hit OK. And I'm just going to delete that and deselect. Now with the brush tool out again, I'm going to bring up the brush drop-down menu and get my new brush right at the bottom. Alright, just a couple of quick changes to make to this brush. Go into the brush panel, and in brush tip shape, I'm just going to rotate it 90 degrees so I can see what I'm doing. And I'm going to space it out so that it looks feathery. I think that looks pretty good. Right, I'm going to size my brush down a little bit. I'm holding shift again, I'm going to draw a straight row of these. Hit Command T, I'm going to rotate it back around. And now holding down the Command button, I'm just going to drag these corners in so that it's nice and tapered. Enter, and then finally add a little stem to it and a little point to the top. Okay, now that I've got all that, I'm going to go into Filter and Liquify, which brings up this menu. Select the Forward Warp tool. And uh, set your brush pressure, something, something not too high, something medium, I think 30 looks pretty good. And then just push the tines of the feather up. Helps to work from the inside out to really get that feathery look. You can see it's, it's starting to work. All right. Hit OK, and there you have it. There's a quick way to draw feathers in Photoshop without actually going in and drawing every single little hair on them. And uh, I mean, if you take a little more time, obviously this is pretty quick, but you can get some pretty cool looking feathers like this, and you can also affect the way that they bend side to side. So I hope this helps you guys out, um, and have fun with the new contest. Happy designing. Bye.